हेलो इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिराइव द मैक्सवेल इक्वेशन द सेकेंड मैक्सवेल इक्वेशन सो फॉर दैट पर्पज वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट विद द एंथेल्पी डेफिनेशन ऑफ द एंथेल्पी एच इज इक्वल टू ई प्लस पी वी दिस इज द डेफिनेशन ऑफ एंथेल्पी एंड वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट विद दिस डेफिनेशन सो इफ यू टेक डिफ्रेंसिएशन ऑफ दिस इक्वेशन then we will get differentiation of h is equal to differentiation of e plus p constant differentiation of v plus v constant differentiation of p this is equation number second now we are going to put the value of d we know that de is nothing but the tds minus pdv equation number 3 now we are going to put this value into here then we will get dh which is equal to T D S minus P D V plus V D P equation number four. Plus P D V remain as it is. So plus P D V get cancelled with minus P D V. Then here what remains? D H is equal to T D S plus V D P. This is equation number five. So here we have two quantities: entropy, change in entropy, and change in pressure. Now, in first step or in first part, we make pressure constant. So if pressure is constant, then change in pressure it is zero. Then if we put the value here, change in pressure is zero. Then this term becomes zero. Then equation five becomes as d h, which is equal to t d s. If you transfer this term to the left hand side, then we will get d h upon d s at constant pressure is equal to t. Then now, then the equation six we can differentiate equation six with respect to pressure. And constant temperature uh, entropy. Then we will get double differentiation of h with entropy with pressure at constant entropy, which is equal to here double di differentiation of t with pressure at constant entropy. This is equation number seven. Now, in second part, we are making entropy constant. So Entropy is constant. For entropy constant, change in entropy is zero. If you put this value, d s is equal to zero into here, this term is zero. Then d h is equal to v d p remain in equation number five. So it is equation number eight. If you transfer this to this side, then you will get d h upon d p. That means variation of enthalpy with pressure at constant. Tem entropy is equal to v. Only v remains. So here equation number seven. If you differentiate equation number seven with respect to entropy and by making pressure constant, then we will get on this side double differentiation of h with pressure with entropy at constant pressure, which is equal to on this side differentiation of with V, uh, differentiation of V volume with entropy at constant pressure. So this is equation number eight. Now here we have two quantities, entropy and pressure. These two, entropy and pressure. Along with that, H. H is a state function. And change in h is the exact differentiation. Then d square h upon d s d p at constant s. That means this is the term at constant entropy is equal to the term this term. So d d square h upon d p d s at constant pressure. This is equation number nine. 
that means the entropy constant term is exactly equal to the pressure constant term if you put the value of this into here equation number 7 here if you put this value here then LHS side of equation 7 and 8 equal then RHS side is also equal then we can write change in temperature with pressure at constant entropy this is the RHS side of equation 7 which is exactly equal to the equation number 8 RHS side of equation number 8 so dv upon ds at constant pressure this is the Maxwell second equation Maxwell thermodynamic second equation this is the variation of temperature with pressure at constant entropy is equal to variation of volume with entropy at constant pressure